हैं कि वेलकम बैक गाइस टू द ट्यूटोरियल ऑफ एस टी एम एल वट वी हैव लर्न इन अवर प्रीवियस ट्यूटोरियल वी हैव लर्न द बेसिक स्ट्रक्चर ऑफ द एस टी एम एल पेज देर इज वुड बी स्टार्ट फ्राम द डॉक्यूमेंट टाइप इट क्लियर द डॉक्यूमेंट टाइप दैट इज एस टी एम एल एंड देन वी स्टार्ट बाई एडिंग द एस टी एम एल टैग एयर देन हेड एंड देन दी हेड देयर कम द टाइटल एंड आफ्टर दैट टाइटल देर कम द बॉडी टैग एंड all the tags we created we should uh, end them by adding the backslash with the same tag and ending the tag we all know that this is necessary otherwise the tag will not work so and uh, in that tags we uh, we learned about the uh, three styles of heading three styles of headings and then how to add paragraphs and uh, mm. Yellow. And how to add the uh, uh, how if we want to add the spaces we use and and as and BSP and how much spaces we want we add the uh, we want that much and BSP and uh, how to add the links in the paragraph of our HTML page and uh, how to add image in our HTML page from the online website or from the same directory if you have a image in our uh, working directory so how can we import it from there and how to comment how to comment any sentence if you don't want it or if you want a comment here and uh, how to make quotations by using the q attributes here and how to use the next line we use br tag for adding the starting the next line and if we want the next line plus the space between the above and the blue lines then we use the pre tag here and moving on okay if we, if we had if we add uh, if we add an image in our website and this image you all know that this image is from i have importing i have imported from my working directory okay if i you 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 people know you really notice that uh, in the website if there will be no internet connection because the um, all the websites usually taking the image is from other website urls so if uh, you open the that web page without the internet connection there will come not that image but instead of that image there comes the uh, uh, info about that image okay not that image comes but the info about that image uh, is showing there if there will be no internet connection so how that can be happen uh, i have added my image here this is the image tag and just i write site and i write there there was my okay and uh, what happens there if uh, uh, i am taking there my image from my working directory my working directory is from here here i am taking this html image okay if there there is the image so that's why it is showing on my web page if uh, i go in my working directory and wait a second if i remove that image and then refresh it and then uh, i save it there and okay you can see and there is no image but there is showing there was my image and it is showing that like okay okay it is uh, giving the info but it is not showing that image but it is giving the info of that image uh, because uh, that image is not in the working directory and this uh, work usually happens the same when you took the image from any website and if that website no longer is available or due to any internet connection problem uh, and the website the web page shows you the info about that image but not that actual image 
so you can do this by simply adding the uh, this side tag this okay moving on we will see how to add uh, moving on we will see how to add tables in our html page okay and we start by simply typing adding the table tag table tag uh, and in that table tag uh, i am adding tr tag what this tag means it uh, it is uh, it is the um, tr tag it is means uh, uh, it is adding a row it is adding row in your table if i write so raw and, and now i am making the column okay this tr tag is for raw and this td is for column how much td i td tag i uh, add here there will be that much column and how much uh, tr tag i add down after that tag and uh, there will be that much rows so i uh, just added one column that is look, student name and then add another and in that row i have added a column td roll numbers okay now we can see what happened here yeah, you can see uh, by td tag we here yeah. by adding a tr tag we made uh, we made a row we made a row two tr tag we have made a two rows and in that row we add a, a column td okay what if we add a second column this will make you clear more td Okay. Now, now you can see a student name. So it has added a column here. It has added a column here. Okay. How many columns I have made here? One, two, three, three, so and so where? these all are the columns i have added here and if i want to add them in the rows i just i just cut and <clears throat> paste over here for time being i am commenting it commenting it out uh, till here okay and in the next row 
I added Yusuf and then the next name and then the next name okay now if I reload it you can see here yeah, I have done a mistake here this uh, I have added in the next row I have added the columns so coming to the I want to make some rows to make you clear concept just go on cutting it and pasting it here Now you can see how it is looking. Come to the code, come to the code. Here you can see mm, first row and the first row I made a column student name and the second column I made roll number. First column student name and the second column roll number. And in the next row I added Yusuf. I added Yusuf and and after that uh, I and after that row I have added uh, uh, two more rows where and then Hasnain but I didn't made there further more columns here only one column so just and this is just uh, I I didn't uh, have attached any kind of uh, CSS in in this code so that's why it is looking that much ugly so if we add uh, some kind of CSS in this code so it will look much more better and we will do it in in our next playlist that would be on the CSS okay moving on further we will have a take a look uh, take a look of uh, list styles list styles in HTML okay moving to the list And there are two types of list in HTML uh, unordered list or ordered list what is the difference between these two lists unordered list is uh, some kind of uh, mm, there would be no numbers there will be no indexes in on that list you know the index uh, 1 2 and 3 and there will be number that uh, you have write something and there would indicating the number that is uh, this is first and then you write second second heading and there would be indicating that this is the second heading and then third and in an unord unordered list there would be no indication of any numbers uh, i am using i am showing now how to display them or can we show Okay, in the unordered list, we just uh, use the tag unordered list tag, and in that tag, we use the tag. Uh, where it goes? This one tag, and I add uh, whatever you want to add here. Just commenting it for your unordered list and 
we have created here the unordered list if we refresh it you can see that uh, this is the unordered list that's why and this is what i am going uh, want to uh, understand you make understand this this is not showing any kind of numbers this is just showing the circles circle marks okay what if we make the ordered list here For order list, what we do, what uh, we just uh, add the tag of uh, order list, and then we add uh, the list tag here. This is our ordered list. You can see the difference after when we refresh it. You can see this is the this is our unordered list and this is our ordered list. It is showing it is clearly showing you the uh, index of first uh, first line. This is one and this is two and indicating this. This is the ordered list and this is the unordered list. So uh, I think this uh, this is I have covered all the CSS. Till now, and now you can you are able easily able to do anything, any kind of sim making a simple web page using the HTML. All the basics and the advanced concepts have been covered in, in this tutorial. And now you are able if you want to uh, if you want to add something more extra, you can search it on the internet easily bye bye take care